Hello everybody, so this is going to be a quick and simple video just showing you this new program slash webpage from Pixar. You guys all know that I was a huge PicMonkey fan slash I still am. However, they changed the way their services work and now you have to pay to save a lot of your photos. Now there are ways around it, you probably have seen on YouTube, but there is a new person in town, a new website in town that is ready to kind of be your new editor. So it is from Pixlr and it's called Pixlr X. So it is in beta version, however, I really enjoy it. It has a lot of the same features as say PicMonkey, however, it is totally free. Now it is beta, which means that they are gonna be making changes and I've actually already suggested a change for them and I will get to that in a bit but let me just show you what the interface looks like. So you're gonna go ahead and open a photo. So for instance, I just made a new channel art um, template or channel art for my vlog channel. If you guys are interested, I'm not gonna push it on you guys, but I am starting a vlog channel with my boyfriend. You guys can check out the link down below. I'm actually in the middle of filming some vlog footage for you guys. So check that out if you're interested. But I know creating channel art has been a huge issue on YouTube ever since PicMonkey closed, or I shouldn't say closed, um, closed their free version, I suppose. Um, anyways, I know there are free parts of it, but a majority of the way PicMonkey used to be, it is not the way that it is now. So. This is where it's at right now. So here you can kind of add text, you can change the effects, you can add overlays. So for instance, we're gonna add an image and I'm just gonna choose a random image here for my computer. So this is an image from Mr. Kate. If you guys don't know her, she's awesome. Love me shout out. But you can add in your photo. You can add text and they also have a lot of different options for text here. And for instance, you could put Whatever you want here you can change the color of it but what's really really cool that you weren't able to do before on a pic monkey unless you had the updated version is you can do outline and you can change it to basically whatever color you want you can do shadow and all different types of things change the text change whatever you need to let's go to this one okay make the size bigger. There's just so many of the really easy ways to edit something, rotation. So it's really easy to make a channel banner and just to edit regular pictures. The one flaw that I find with it is that the layers, you can't like change the order of the layers. So say for instance that you wanted, I don't know, like one thing to be on top of each other and it can't you can't do it here like you can't like drag and drop but hopefully that's something that they can change other than that this is amazing it's almost like pick monkey and it's very much free it's going to be updating like i said so i just wanted to let you guys know about this um and yeah let me know down below what you guys think were you guys a huge fan of pig monkey and were you sad that they kind of changed their services because i totally was anyways let me know down below and i'll see you next time bye